Hi, Alex from Connectify here. Right now, streaming and group video calls are more important than ever. On the latest version of Speedify, we've added a revolutionary new feature called Streaming Mode that optimizes Speedify's channel bonding for things like video calls and live streaming broadcasts. I'm using it right now to meet over a Zoom video call with you from my backyard. To let you see what's going on, I'm gonna turn on screen sharing so that you can watch my Speedify app over the Zoom link. Streaming mode automatically recognizes when you're on a voice or video call or broadcasting live and does three things for the stream. First, it prioritizes the live streams over any other traffic. Second, if your connections aren't fast enough, it will actually bond them together, sending some data on Wi-Fi and some on cellular to give you the speed you need. Finally, if your connections are dropping packets, like at the edge of range of your Wi-Fi, like where I am right now, since I'm walking away from my house, it will actually send the stream's data packets redundantly on both connections at once and only deliver whichever copy gets through first. This gives you a rock solid connection, no matter how bad the link gets. As I walk even further from my Wi-Fi signal, you're gonna see that it goes from redundant mode to the Wi-Fi actually dropping. But when this happens, the call isn't interrupted. There it goes. Because Speedify streaming mode shifted to only using the cellular connection. Once I get back into Wi-Fi range, it'll automatically reconnect and change back to streaming with bonding, optimizing speed for stronger connections. It works great with things like Zoom, Google Meet, Hangouts, Skype, FaceTime, WhatsApp calls, Twitch streaming, house party, and Instagram Live. Check it out in the latest version of Speedify. Bye everyone, stay safe out there.